And it's not just an issue at Pittsburgh Public Schools. There is a critical need for bus drivers in other school districts as bus companies scramble to cover the needed bus routes. Yeah, you see a lot of signs, you know, now hiring when it comes to this. So what does it take to actually be a school bus driver? John Shumway checked in on a class at ABC Transit. Anything from the rear axle forward is amber. Anything from the rear axle back is red. Before you can drive it, you need to know your bus. And it'll activate all of your lights, your ambers, um, oh, okay. your eight ways. Uh, your clearance lights, your turn signals, you can do a full walk around. It's, it's a lot more than what you ever expect to come with it. She's got her master switch on, so she should activate her amber lights how far? 150 to 300 feet. Correct. I found out that they desperately needed need drivers because my daughter didn't have a bus driver. Drawn to this class by a number of reasons, these folks will be ready for the start of school and are part of the solution to the driver shortage. Activating her hazard lights. It's definitely serious. So serious, the bus companies are competing and offering incentives. We, we have a $2,500 bonus if you are a CDL uh, school bus and passenger uh, certified. And we have a $1,000 bonus for any van driver that walks through the door. And another $1,000 for van drivers to upgrade to the big bus, which is what Tisha Colbert is doing. Well, actually, the scheduling is really, really good for me because I'm a mom and uh, trying to become an entrepreneur and everything. So, you know, the scheduling really is very convenient. All right. Flexibility is a key selling point. If they have a, a problem with child care, we'll work with the drivers to allow them to take their children to school and leave from the bus garage with their children. The most important thing about driving the bus is being able to stop it. Well, that's so. important. We want to be able to stop. Yes. The actual handling of the bus is mostly about knowing how big it is and making steering adjustments so you're clear of everything in turns and constantly scanning the mirrors. Oh, that part doesn't scare me at all. I think I'm a pretty good driver. Oshel says they are looking at route changes and asking drivers to do a little bit more to cover all of the bus stops and get the kids to school. And they are constantly starting new classes. In the end, you're going to spend about four to five weeks being trained. Six hours of that is actually on road training and then, of course, testing. And the pay, over $21 an hour. John Shumway, KDKA News.